this is how I trim my beard. Give me a good comb, comb everything out. Start with that Andis. If you ain't got that Andis outliner, I don't know what you're doing. But I start around my top lip, get everything lined up pretty good. Line around the top lip. We want everything symmetrical too. Make sure when you cut, you get a comb in between. If you ain't combing, you ain't getting everything. <coughs> trimming up the top of my mustache now I don't like how it leads up into my nose so I cut that off straight across and then trim down on the mustache so now we get these side hairs in the side of your mouth these are the ones that grow and get into your mouth I hate these so I'm pull those out and then trim them back Nice little line around. I don't like it too sharp, so I just go light on it. So that's good around the mouth area. Now we're gonna shave off this excess and get a nice clean line towards the ear. This time I'm letting the mustache flow into it instead of uh, cutting it down and back. We'll get a little Rick Ross on now. Looking pretty good, not too sharp. But there is definitely a line, so you can compare both sides and see, you know, it looks a lot better. Now we go to the other side and try to be symmetrical with it, as close as you can. Of course, I'm doing this by myself, so I can't really see it too good as if I was standing in front of me. But we're going to get as close as we can. Sometimes you got to move your hands in some awkward ways to get the right uh, cut. When you're going on the opposite side, I'm right-handed. Cutting on my left side, it get a little awkward. And if you ain't got your pinky out, you ain't doing it right. Comb, make sure everything is looking good. These are my favorite combs to use on my beard. This gold one is my number one go to, my everyday comb. So now we're going to trim up the beard, get it looking right. Right now we just got hair everywhere. So we just take a little bit off all the way around. Try to get a little bit of fade up up top, but I'm not, I'm not crispy with the fade work, so I just cut it back a little bit. It's looking better already. You 
You don't want to go in too deep. Just take off a little bit at a time. It'll all go back, though. If you make a mistake, it'll be all right. But you want to get it right the first time. Just take a little bit at a time. See, I got a little bit of fade on one side. Now that was bushy, so we're going to try and cut it back some. This is the part that grows the most, is the chin area on the sides of the chin. <clears throat> <laughs> Be on that confidence. I use Baba's beard butter. And my beard is all natural and it's the shit. As soon as you use it, it's like a detangler as well. So here we are all done doing the final comb. Check everything out. Build that confidence. Looking good. Bye bye's beard butter. You need to get that. I'll put the link in the uh comment too.